very nice good afternoon my dear lovely uh, i heartily welcome to all of you in today's online academic counseling class of information system for managers i hope soon our uh, more learners will join and they will get the benefit from this online academic counseling class first of all i ask to all of you all of you attended my earlier academic counseling class on information technology or information system for the manager if you have any query if you have any doubt you are requested to uh please ask how the information system for manager is fruitful for you as a student of master of business administration how the information system is helpful for you no issue dear learners i know very well all of you are doing excellent job all of you working hard to achieve your goal through pursuing your masters in business administration from indira gandhi nation open university so i will uh, going to start the second very important unit of the information system for manager uh, now i'm going to share the e content from the gyan course Uh, dear learners today we will discuss the com uh, computer system and smart devices this is the unit number 2 here we will try to understand the introductory part objectives components of a computer central processing units cpu storage and storage devices input output devices networking and networking devices plug and play devices smart devices uh, communication technology types of the computer and uh, more important practical aspect when we talk about the computer system and smart devices edge all of you know very well information system is very important in today's lpg era liberalization privatization and globalization uh, many of us says today's era is the era of information technology vartman yug जो है वह सूचना तकनीक का युग है सो इट इज अ वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट हाउ द इंफॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी हाउ द इंफॉर्मेशन इज वेरी मच हेल्पफुल फॉर आवर सिस्टम बिफोर नोइंग हाउ द इंफॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी इज वेरी मच हेल्पफुल फॉर आवर सिस्टम और इकोनॉमी वी मस्ट try to understand how the information system run how the information system um, play the important role what are the various important pillars if i will ask to my learners they are attending if i will ask to you uh, how information system will work who will reply अगर मैं आपसे पूछूं कि सूचना प्रणाली किस प्रकार से कार्य करेगी तो आप क्या उत्तर देंगे 
my learners if i will ask to you how information system will work what you will reply anyone no issue uh, dear uh, learners uh, you know very well information system work on the basis of the hardware and the software hardware means specifically that are the various physical components of the information technology software means various programs that designed by the software engineers the computer science engineers for uh, achieving the specific objective what you want to do uh, here today uh, we will study a very important uh, computer system and devices computer system and smart devices learners for an information system hardware is defined as any machinery that helps in input processing storage and output activities information for an information system hardware is defined as any machinery jo hardware hai hum us machinery ko sayant ko kahenge jo humko processing storage aur output ke gatividhiyon mein help karti hai for information system hardware is is defined as any machinery that helps in input processing storage and output activities uh, when we uh, take uh, this in the computer similarly for the computer the hardware is the collection of devices that perform the functions of input if you, uh, any uh, person ask uh, what do you mean by the hardware you will reply the hardware is the collection of devices hardware is the collection of devices suppose uh, today all of you connected in this academic online class through your mobile phones through your laptop through your desktop or uh, some persons connected here from the various other modes if i will ask to you dear learner uh, uh, anyone can tell me what are the various devices you are using to connect me for attending this class who will reply through mobile sir mobile thank you through mobile yes uh, suppose if uh, i will uh, say uh, mobile is broader uh, equipment mobile yes sir uh, yes. very good uh, but uh, some uh, other uh, devices are here also here the important word hardware is the collection of devices that perform the function of input uh, input processing data storage and output this is the very important yeah this uh, suppose if uh, i will say to you if i am uh, here uh, in front of all of you the virtually first of all i am using my desktop second there is the speaker whatever you are um, uh, saying i am listening from my speaker i am not using any uh, earphone second i am uh, in front of you all of you seeing my uh, seeing me by webcam uh, this is the um, camera uh, all of you are just uh, um, viewing my uh, me through your mobile through your desktop and um, laptop plus here is the one keyboard is also from where i move this uh, e content and uh, uh, broadly uh, this and the cpu is here the desktop a monitor is in front of me 
these are the broader uh, uh, equipment uh, you are understanding that is uh, with me uh, desktop uh, webcam uh, key, um, keyboard speaker and cpu these are the one two three four and five items are in my in front of me so the hardware is the uh, basically the hardware is the collection of the devices yeah jo hai हार्डवेयर को जब हम कहेंगे तो कहेंगे ये कलेक्शन ऑफ डिवाइसेस है जो हमको इनपुट को प्रोसेस करने में मदद करता है बिकॉज इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट फॉर द करेंट मैनेजर्स जो सूचना प्रणाली होती है वह किसी भी प्रबंधक के लिए बहुत ज्यादा महत्वपूर्ण होती है सूचना प्रणाली किसी भी प्रबंधक के लिए बहुत ज्यादा महत्वपूर्ण होती है सूचना के अंदर क्वालिटी होनी चाहिए हो कि वो प्रॉम्प्ट हो वह एकट हो वह सही समय सही व्यक्ति को मिल जाए लेकिन यह कब संभव है यह संभव तब है जब आपके पास हार्डवेयर जिसको कहते हैं कि हार्डवेयर इज द कलेक्शन ऑफ द डिवाइसेस वह आपके पास अच्छा हो जैसे आ, मेरे बहुत सारे लर्नर उससे जुड़े हुए हैं अगर मेरे पास सही से वेब कैमरा नहीं होगा देन हाउ यू विल से हु इज टीचिंग मी हु इज माय एकेडमिक काउंसलर बाय दिस ऑल ऑफ योर व्यू मी माय सेल्फ डॉक्टर सपन अस्थाना इज टेकिंग योर एकेडमिक काउंसलिंग क्लास सो यू आर वेरी वेल यू आर सीइंग मी इन दिस एकेडमिक काउंसलिंग क्लास एंड बीइंग ए एकेडमिक काउंसलर i am also viewing my all the learners uh, if uh, your uh, video is on i am seeing you if your uh, video is off then what uh, dp you uh, what is your profile you um, keep on your uh, uh, login i am seeing to you in other word we can say the all the physical units of the computer system constitute computer hardware learner you know very well the all the physical units जो भी चीज हमें जो है एक ठोस के रूप में एक भौतिक रूप में फिजिकल यूनिट के रूप में हम देख पा रहे हैं जो हमारे सिस्टम को बना रहा है कंप्यूटर को वह सभी हार्डवेयर के अंतर्गत आते हैं द इनपुट डिवाइस गेट्स द डेटा फ्रॉम द आउटसाइड वर्ल्ड एंड द डेटा इज स्टोर्ड इन द मेमोरी यस इनपुट इनपुट डिवाइसेस का मतलब होता है कि किसके द्वारा आप इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम में जो है रॉ मटेरियल को पुट करते हैं जैसे मुझे आपको कोई मैसेज देना है इफ आई एम थिंकिंग टू प्रोवाइड यू सम मैसेज आई विल राइट फ्रॉम दिस कीबोर्ड कीबोर्ड से मैं उसको लिखूंगा और आपके चैट सेक्शन में मैसेज रिफ्लेक्ट होगा मैंने इनपुट की था और आउटपुट आपको मैसेज वहां से प्राप्त हो रहा है इन अदर वर्ड्स ऑल दि फिजिकल यूनिट्स ऑफ द कंप्यूटर सिस्टम कंस्टिट्यूट कंप्यूटर हार्डवेयर द इनपुट डिवाइस गेट्स द डेटा फ्रॉम द आउटसाइड वर्ल्ड एंड द डेटा इज स्टोर्ड इन द मेमोरी द सेंट्रल प्रोसेसिंग यूनिट सी पी यू प्रोसेस द डेटा एंड द वेरियस आउटपुट डिवाइस प्रोवाइड द रिजल्ट आई लव यू नो वेरी वेल cpu is the very important central processing unit without cpu no any meaning of any computer system you also know uh, the components uh, communicate with each other through system uh, was each hardware component play an important role in computing the arrangement um, the arrangement uh, of the component within system even today is what was suggested in 1947 here very clearly mentioned as stored program concept of the computing by on numens and is known as the on numen uh, architecture ye aap isko dekh sakte hain important hai the smart devices use internet or the uh, organizational network and work at the information uh, processor uh, and information providers um, okay this is the very important what are the smart devices like internet internet uh, 
जो है ये इसको आप जो है स्मार्ट डिवाइसेस कहेंगे स्मार्ट डिवाइसेस यूज ऑफ द इंटरनेट और द ऑर्गेनाइजेशनल नेटवर्क एंड वर्क एट द इंफॉर्मेशन प्रोसेसर्स एंड द इंफॉर्मेशन प्रोवाइडर्स प्रोसेसर जो इंफॉर्मेशन को फ्रूटफुल आउटपुट में दे और प्रोवाइडर जो आउटपुट को रिफ्लेक्ट करे जैसे प्रोसेसर व्हाट आई एम राइटिंग सपोज मैंने एक्सेल पे कुछ लिख दिया और एक्सेल पे लिखने के बाद और जो आप उसको ऐड करते हैं आप उसको मल्टीप्लाई करते हैं आप उसको जो भी आप मैथमेटिकल फॉर्मुलेशन फार्मूला लगा के आउटपुट देते हैं वह जो रिफ्लेक्ट होता है वह इंफॉर्मेशन प्रोवाइडर्स स्मार्ट डिवाइस इज एन इलेक्ट्रॉनिक डिवाइस इंपॉर्टेंट द स्मार्ट डिवाइस इज एन इलेक्ट्रॉनिक डिवाइस जनरली कनेक्ट टू अदर डिवाइस और नेटवर्क वाई डिफरेंट वायरलेस प्रोटोकॉल सच एट द ब्लूटूथ वाई फाई एक्सेट्रा Uh, dear learners you know very well today's the in this it era lot of these smart devices are developed in our society many time all of you listen uh, in the very weak examination unfair means uh, the bluetooth used by the candidate and um, he copy the uh, contents uh, or he got the some unfair means from the outside how this is possible by the bluetooth okay so as on date lot of the examinations conducted uh, the jammers are uh, used during the examinations how many learners know what do you mean by the jammers if i uh, i will ask to you what do you mean by jammers which will obstruct signal sir thank you thank you learner jammers means uh, uh, an electronic device that um, uh, that disable uh, the various uh, signals um, uh, 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 jammer is uh, completely the security item and we can't uh, install jammer without the permission of the specific uh, police authority i hope all of you know very well if you are not knowing you must know jammer is not the private uh, persons uh, this uh, is property you use any time no 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 jammer this is completely the security and uh, you can't uh, use jammer without the prior permission and big examinations you the uh, use this jammer so we can say the bluetooth wifi uh, bluetooth and wifi these are the just uh, smart devices and uh, you become the good manager uh, when you know about the smart devices and not only you know the um, uh, smart devices you must know the application of the smart devices this is the important because uh, today you are uh, pursuing your mba from the indira gandhi national open university and uh, just after completion of uh, this uh, program i love you become a good manager so you must know uh, how the various important uh, smart devices work that can operate to some extent interactively and autonomously they can be used in almost any industry from smart manufacturing to healthcare helping to improve the efficiency and optimize operations various type of the smart devices are used in any industry and firm uh, what uh, level of the smart devices are using um, this also determine the organizations could well suppose all of your manager in very good company if you are using the high technology every one like you because today is the era of the information technology and if you are using the smart devices it means you are in the race of the globalization you are in the race of the privatization you are in the race of the liberalization so it is the very important you take the interest to know the what are the smart devices how they will work okay uh, you will take the example of the atm uh, how many learners know as on date without atm card you can withdraw the money 
each any learner know the concept yes ya no mera prashn hai kitne vidyarthi jante hain कि अगर आपके पास एटीएम कार्ड नहीं है और आप एटीएम से पैसा विड्रा कर सकते हैं नो no. बैंकिंग uh, से होता है यस yes, बैंकिंग से है और एटीएम से है मतलब आप एटीएम uh, 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 किसी भी एटीएम को आप विजिट किए और आपके पास एटीएम कार्ड बाय डिफॉल्ट आपके पास नहीं है घर पे रह गया ऑफिस में रह गया तो टेक्नोलॉजी है आपका जो नंबर होता है उससे किस प्रकार से मनी विड्रॉल होगी दिस दिस इज द एप्लीकेशन ऑफ द स्मार्ट डिवाइसेस एंड द टेक्नोलॉजी सो यू ट्राई टू नो ट्राई टू एक्सप्लोर दैट एप्लीकेशन लर्नर्स एज यू नो द इंफॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी एंड द इंफॉर्मेशन सिस्टम इज द वेरी वेरी प्रोडक्ट aspect but we must know how uh, the computer system work what are the various uh, how we will identify the components of the computer system what are the various elements of the cpu how networking work and use plug and play devices and understand about the smart devices suppose uh, if our manager edge has on date uh, is spending his more than 80% time in the informational system with the informational system when he rise in the morning from the whatsapp to late evening various social media everything is the uh, product of the information technology so you must know the what are the things how they will work and the fundamental is our computer system first of all you know because your mobile is also the one computer system that is a small computer um, structure is different um, components of the computer this is the components of the computer i hope all of you are studied the various uh, uh, computer paper in your uh, earlier classes but being a academic counselor of the information system for the managers here again we need to discuss because this is in your syllabus the components of the computer uh, the cpu uh, input devices input devices uh, and the primary storage the secondary storage um, central processing unit arithmetic and logic unit the control unit and communication devices output devices uh, output devices communication devices the component of a computer what are the various components of the computer the input devices central processing unit arithmetic and logic unit control unit primary storage secondary storage communication devices output devices okay these are the various important components input devices through this devices you uh, give the data to the our system this input devices input devices uh, and this uh, if i will ask you learners my webcam is input devices or the output devices who will answer if i will ask to you Uh, webcam is input devices or output devices please reply webcam is input devices or the output devices webcam is input devices because this is capturing the primary storage and if i will ask you uh, monitor who will tell me the monitor monitor is output the device, uh, input or the output output device sir. good monitor is the output devices inputs through a dark away uh, give the input 
to the our system in the detail here everything is mentioned the computer memory is categorized into the primary storage and the secondary storage the primary storage stores the data and programs uh, during the processing and uh, secondary uh, storage is used to store the data and program for future when you are doing any specific job the, all the uh, things come under the primary storage but for the future uh, perspective use the secondary storage the communication devices connect a computer to other computers and devices to facilitate data exchange with them these are the various uh, generations of the computer as you uh, many times listen uh, the computer have been around since 1940s and have been evolving ever since the computer hardware and mainly uh, evolved through four stages what are the four stages london uh, so called the first generation uh, computer 1946 to 1956 uh, this duration come under the first generation computer and second this is the second generation london 1947 57 to 1963 and third 1964 to 1979 and uh, the fourth this uh, 1979 onward all of you listen many times the B, uh, VS, uh, vlsi large uh, very large scale integrated how many learners are seen the pcos in their life pcos no that is also the very uh, our uh, uh, traditional uh, uh, public calling system uh, very popular but nowadays the mobile takes place so no in our society out of the pcos very less numbers um, this is the operating system operating system is the important uh, software by uh, this perform the two functions extend the machine extend the machine operating system present to the user an extended machine that is easier to program than the underlying the hardware and manage the resource such as processor uh, memories uh, uh, and uh, timers disk mouse network printer etc uh, operating system provide an orderly and the control allocation of the resources among the various programs uh, competing for them you say hamare bahut sare aise learner honge jab wo desktop ya laptop ya koi bhi unka even mobile bhi hai tablet hai smartphone hai to praye prashn aate hai ki aapka ye operating system operating system kaise work kar raha hai to ye jo operating system hai basically operating system do prakar ke karyo ko karta hai ek operating system presents to the user an extended machine that is easier to program than the underlying hardware Take first second kya hai ki manage resources all the resources jaise memories hai timers hai disk hai mouse hai network hai printer hai in sab cheezon ko bhi operating system se manage kiya jata hai operating system provide an orderly and the control allocation of the resources among the various programs um, and competing for them so you must know uh, keep knowledge about the operating system uh, for the information learners all of you generally use the laptop you use the um, and uh, desktop and smartphones uh, we, you try to uh, uh, increase your curiosity if you know about the functioning of the items you will take interest the knowledge will increase central processing unit that is the very important component in order to work a computer needs some sort of the brain okay suppose all of you are uh, in class you have brain given by the god at the core of each computer there is device called the central processing unit cpu which is the brain of the computer suppose if anybody asks you ki 
uh, what is the CPU? You can say the CPU is the brain of the computer. Uh, it means uh, what our brain will uh, perform. Our brain perform take the inputs and uh, give the output. This is the function of the brain. Uh, brain. Up press puchenge. Our brain will process karega or up answer karega. In the same way, uh, we can say the central processing unit CPU which is the brain of the computer jo computer ka mastisk hota hai the cpu reads the program from the main memory and executes each step of the program which may involve calculation and the decision making the cpu is responsible for controlling all devices of the computer through its component yes uh, the central processing unit is responsible for controlling all the devices of computer through its components the con control unit it initiate a mem uh, memory operation which may involve reading data from an in input device and storing uh, it into memory or read data from the memory and display it on the output devices as we discussed here the cpu mainly consists of the three parts what are the three parts the control unit arithmetic and logic unit and its storage also referred to as cpu registers okay control unit arithmetic and logic unit and its store is also referred to as cpu registers these are the three important parts of the um, component of the cpu i hope all of you understanding well uh, this is about the cpu uh, this is about the computer speed the world length of the CPUs, uh, each, the number of the bits it can process in a single cycle. A 64 bit machine can process 64 bits in the single cycle. This is the speed. Up soon, gigabyte, megabyte, kilohertz. So, yes, computer speeds go, uh, technologies, hand. Storage and uh, storage devices the large amount of the data is stored uh, on the computer uh, using various type of the uh, storage devices learners as you know like your brain as you earlier studied the cpu central uh, um, processing unit your brain is also key the data uh, same way same way our system is also to store uh, the various type of the data here the large amount of the data is stored on a computer using various type of the storage media the storage media are uh, distinguished by their relative speed capacity uh, resilience to failure uh basically the two uh volatile storage and non-volatile storage uh, when we talk about the volatile storage the information residing in such storage needs continuous power supply the contents are lost if the power supply is switched off jo volatile storage hai, Usme koi bhi sushna jo ek memory ko store kiya ja raha hai. Information residing in such storage needs continuous power supply. Hame sa jab tak power hai, tab tak ko sushna hai. Aksar aap dekhte honge koi aap kari karte hai, aapne system pe jab tak aap usko lik sakte hai, dekhte hai, to usko aapne agar koi save nahi kiya hai, to hai aur agar Light chali gayi immediately band ho gaya. To aap usko retrieve nahi kar paate. 
the contents are lost in the power supply is switched off. The examples of this such storage devices are main memory and catch memory, which we will discuss in the next section. You see, or the apne again course ki contents of now detailed may be hai. So access to the volatile storage is very fast, both because of the technology used and the because of the access methods. Uh, non-volatile storage ki agar aap baat kariye, the non-volatile uh, storage media do not require the power supply to retain their contents. Example of such storage media are disk and the magnetic tapes. Disk is used for the online storage while the tapes are used for the um, archival storage. Disk and the uh, magnetic tapes are very uh, reliable uh, storage media. The current technology used for non-volatile storage make them uh, much slower than volatile storage. When we talk about the main memory, that is the very important. All of you uh, generally uh, listen this word, byte, kilobyte, megabyte, gigabyte, and terabyte. If I will ask to you, ki sabse jyada storage capacity ki kya hoti hai? Who will reply? If I will ask to you, ki sabse jyada jo capacity hai, what is it? So, what do you Sir, terabyte. Uh, thank you. Yes. Terabyte is the maximum capacity memory. Here is very important the commonly used names and the abbreviations for the storage capacity. All of you are seeing the byte, this one byte, and in one kilobyte, if I will ask to you, in the one kilobyte, how many byte? Who will reply? In one kilobyte, how many byte? 1024, sir. Yes, this is in front of you. The um, clear statical table in front of you. This is the table. And megabyte? One uh, hundred twenty-four into one hundred twenty-four, about one million. And gigabyte, the three times, one hundred twenty-four into one hundred twenty-four into one hundred twenty-four, and terabyte, four times when you multiply each of them, one hundred uh, one thousand twenty-four into one thousand twenty-four into one thousand twenty-four into one thousand twenty-four, and gigabyte. 1024 into 1024 into 1024 megabyte two times 1024 into 1024 generally all of you purchase your pen drive suppose if i will ask you you will purchase generally pen drive how much memory In GB, sir. Correct. In GB, and generally uh, 1 GB, 2 GB, 4 GB, 10 GB, or 20 GB. This is our maximum. Uh, suppose, uh, just I will um, like this. But uh, when uh, Information Technology Department um, just purchase some uh, memory devices, that is the terabyte, na? TB. So I hope all of you are understanding this figure also. You remember byte, kilobyte, megabyte, gigabyte, and terabyte. Byte, byte, kilobyte. After kilobyte, megabyte. After megabyte, gigabyte. After gigabyte, terabyte. This is the storage capacity of the your. Um, important uh, aspect uh, storage capacity when we discuss this some content the main memory heads the program uh, and data required by the cpu for carrying out its operations the uh, primary storage is a 
semiconductor device that is built uh, using integrated cir uh, circuits. The data is stored in binary uh, form by main memory, numeric as well as non-numeric data can be uh, presented in binary form. After the binary form, uh, with uh, two binary digits, we can represent four different characters. These are the important things of your e-gam course content. Mein hai. I hope ki all of you are also downloaded the e-content. How many learners are downloaded the e-content? How many? Learners, this is the important. Everything is important, not this is only. So you must uh, read uh, very sincerely and attentively when you have time at your home. The type of the main memory, the memory can be various types like the random access memory and the read only memory. The figure 2.2 given the below uh, gives the description of the memory. Generally, you talk about what is the RAM and ROM. RAM RAM is ROM. RAM Random Access Memory. And ROM Read Only Memory. Suppose if I will ask you, which si memory is being a information technology manager? What do you use? What do you use? If I will ask you which type of the memory you will use more, what you will reply? If I will ask you, RAM had become the synonyms of the main memory. Earlier, the word core memory was used for the referring the main memory. Definitely, a lot of you use the uh for different purpose use the different memory you can say alag alag udeshon ke liye alag alag jo hai aap memory ko use karenge to ek drum hai dynamic random access memory has been the most common kind of the ram the data is stored uh, in the cell of the transistor and the capacitors of the data has refreshed um every a few uh milliseconds uh, this could uh the domain hai random or read ram random access memory and rom read only memory ram uh, uh ram um, give you two part aka yes drm and head ram and read only memory eprom and pro yeah, from stop you have to detail with you have to ram hair ticket yes jam hair stop at just a person second uh, secondary memory had the main uh, memory provides a small amount of uh, volatile storage but a computer needs to store large amount of the data and instructions permanently the secondary memory is non volatile and has large capacity the uh, secondary memory is slow as compared to the main memory. Yes. Let's go up. Or per second, just say sequential access storage devices, hai, direct access storage devices. So, if you have information uh, system for managers, ka jo paper, you will be able to get more and more information technology. Ke bise mein jaan sakke aur sakke. Just say activity. Hai. The activity has computers, motherboard, processor, and CPU are the same or different things. If I will ask you, computer ka motherboard, processor, and CPU are the same or different thing, who will reply? But the activity is very important. Hoti hai. Activity aapko help karti hai, chijo ko understand karne. बताएंगे कि कंप्यूटर का जो मदरबोर्ड है जो प्रोसेसर है और जो सीपीयू है 
वह सेम है या डिफरेंट है धन्यवाद सेम मदरबोर्ड कंटेन्स द प्रोसेसर एंड एंड एंडे सिस्टम इज कॉल्ड सीपीयू थैंक यू मदरबोर्ड प्रोसेसर एंड सीपीयू आर से गुड और जो आपका सेकंड है ये कैच एंड रैम का डिफरेंस है तो कैच आप यहां देख सकते हैं इट इज द हाई स्पीड मेमोरी एंड एक्सपेंसिव एंड इसमें क्या है रैम रैम आपने आगे ऊपर अभी देख लिया है यहां पे रैम रैंडम एक्सेस मेमोरी ये जो एक्टिविटी है इसको आप लोग थोड़ा सा अपने नोटबुक पे जरूर किया करिए इससे आपका और अच्छा रहेगा जब आप चीजों को समझेंगे इनपुट एंड आउटपुट डिवाइसेस है दीज आर दी they are used as the medium of the communication between the external environment and the cpu the input is provided to the computer through the input devices and the output is given through the output devices the main input and output devices are controlled by the cpu a computer system may also have the devices under the control of the cpu the uh, dedicated for the controlling the input output devices इनपुट डिवाइसेस ये इनपुट इसको आप देखिए बड़ा इंटरेस्टिंग है आपका दिस कैटेगरी है जैसे कीइंग डिवाइस कीइंग डिवाइसेस कीइंग डिवाइसेस का मतलब जब आप किसी भी इनपुट को डिवाइसेस में अपडेट uh, करते हैं जैसे कीबोर्ड है पंच कार्ड रीडर है पॉइंटिंग डिवाइसेस पॉइंटिंग डिवाइसेस यानी किसी को जब आपको पॉइंट करना है जैसे मैं आपको पढ़ा रहा हूँ और मुझे बताना है माउस कहा लिखा है तो मैं आपको पॉइंट दिस इज पॉइंट किंग दिस टेबल टू पॉइंट टू दिस दिस माउस ये माउस है ठीक है टच स्क्रीन अलाफ यू कैन यूज द ए टी एम मशीन दैट इज ऑल्सो द एग्जाम्पल ऑफ दच स्क्रीन जो आई स्टेक and light pens are the pointing devices voice recognizers and you know very well optical character uh, recognizer ocr all of you understand nowadays all of you are definitely studying and uh, coming days you get the good opportunity and uh, i hope when you appeared in the various competitive examinations then such type of the uh things you um go through in front of your eyes like barcode reader qr code reader and qr code reader is a very popular in nowadays when you see the any um um information from this optical mark reader omr and the optical character reader ocr optical scanner other devices cameras dg uh, डिजिटाइजर्स फॉर द मैप एंड ग्राफ्स एक्सेट्रा स्मार्ट कार्ड्स टेलीफोन एंड अदर हैंडहेल्ड डिवाइसेस फॉर कैप्चरिंग डेटा एंड इंफॉर्मेशन दिस आर द इनपुट डिवाइसेस कैटेगरी एंड द नेम ऑफ द डिवाइसेस रियली माय लर्नर्स आई ऑलवेज एप्रिशिएट ऑल ऑफ यू द योर कंटेंट दैट यू डाउनलोडेड फ्रॉम द ई ज्ञान कोर्स very very rich and informative so being a student of the masters in the business administration and the student of the information system for the managers you go to very helpful for your managerial career because all of you pursue your mba for become the good manager who is the good manager who use the technology for managerial point of view is the good manager if you are a manager not using the uh, technology especially the information technology no not good so i always uh, request to all of you you must use these are the various inputs output devices uh, just we discussed the monitor printer audio devices speakers headphones projectors and the plotters and televisions 
uh, and uh, uh, Brillia readers, GPS, global positioning system devices, video card learners. These are the um, uh, these are the various uh, we can say uh, output I/O input and output devices. May output devices uh, they are generating some result for you. The output device uh, output uh, generated by the computer can be transmitted to the user via the several devices and the media. Uh, these devices are the card output devices. Following are the same important monitor. Suppose uh, I want to teach you the information system for managers through so the e uh, content from uh, e -GAN force. So I am moving the my PDF. All of these things. This is the output and printers suppose uh, i want uh, some important information of you so i will take from i need in writing i will give the print of your attendance the printer is the also the very important output devices there are two broad categories of the printers impact and non-impact printers impact printers use the sticking accent to press a, a carbon again against paper to create a character these are the various as you know i don't the various type of the printers are working this uh, information technology bahut sare prakar ke printer aate hain aapne dekha hoga 2 in 1 3 in 1 4 in 1 usme aap properly scan kar sakte hain usme properly aap jo hai scan ke sath sath uh, scan karne ke baad uh, usse uh, print le sakte hain और और जो है किस प्रकार से इलेक्ट्रॉनिकली बहुत सारे एप्लीकेशंस को एक कर दिया गया देयर आर टू ब्रॉड कैटेगरीज ऑफ द प्रिंटर्स इंपैक्ट नॉन इंपैक्ट प्रिंटर्स तो आप देखिए कि इंफॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी किस प्रकार से आगे बढ़ रही है ऑडियो डिवाइसेस स्पीकर्स एंड हेडफोन्स द आउट गोइंग ऑडियो डेटा रिक्वायर्स द साउंड एम फ्राई डिवाइसेस सब लोग जानते हैं कि ऑडियो डिवाइसेस क्या है किस प्रकार से कार्य करता है एंड द फ्यू सच ऑडियो आउटपुट डिवाइसेस आर स्पीकर्स एंड द हेडफोन्स दिस आउटपुट डिवाइसेस आर कनेक्टेड टू द मेन कंप्यूटिंग डिवाइसेस प्रोजेक्टर है द प्रोजेक्टर्स आर अनदर टाइप ऑफ द डिस्प्ले डिवाइसेस uh all of you know nowadays the projector is less used but earlier lot of the times projector are used plotters they use computer uh, driven pens for the creating black and white or color graphic image uh, like chart graphs etc television televisions are the most famous and the commonly used output devices and uh, uh, braille uh, reader uh, braille readers are as the name says uh, are used to facilitate the computer function uh, function handling uh, to blind readers ye jo hai ब्रेन लिपि जैसे होती है उसी प्रकार से ब्रेली रीडर्स है और जीपीएस है सब जानते हैं ग्लोबल पोजिशनिंग सिस्टम तो ये भी एक जो है आउटपुट डिवाइसेस है एंड वीडियो कार्ड नेटवर्किंग एंड एंड नेटवर्किंग डिवाइसेस की अगर हम बात करें नेटवर्किंग लैन है और uh, आप लोग अक्सर नाम सुनते होंगे नेटवर्क का कि लैन पे है किस पे सिस्टम है द नेटवर्क द ग्रुप ऑफ द कंप्यूटर्स प्रिंटर्स एंड अदर Uh, devices that are connected together with the cables okay agar aapke office ke sabhi system ek sath connect hain to uske liye aap uh, jo work karte hain wo sab aapka networking hai sab diya hai dekhiye aap ring structure hybrid structure start structure tree structure bus structure kis prakar se aapka types of the network uh, topologies तो अक्सर जो है ये प्रश्न आता भी है कि नेटवर्क टोपोलॉजी क्या है तो आपको बताना होगा हाइब्रिड नेटवर्क इज द कम्बिनेशन ऑफ द टू आर मोर टोपोलॉजी हाइब्रिड दिस स्टार स्ट्रक्चर रिंग स्ट्रक्चर ट्री स्ट्रक्चर एंड बस स्ट्रक्चर नेटवर्क डिवाइसेस क्या है प्लग एंड प्ले डिवाइसेस बात की गई है यूएस वन कैन प्लग in for instance usb universal serial bus uh, what uh, activity hai what were the main reason for the change from the serial uh, 
printer game uh, and uh, PS Object 2 ports to the USB ports. Smart devices kya hai? Uh, discuss ho raha hai. Tots, uh, IoT, Internet of Things. This is the very new technology come in the uh, information technology, communication technology. Okay, sender, signal, receiver, transmission. Uh, types of the computer, mainframe, mini computers, and the workstation, micro computer, network computer, summaries, scope, study, kar sakte, sare se questions. Uh, to is pragar se, ko, kafi, is me, madat milegi, dear learners. I am so happy that all of you attended my this today's lecture on the information system for managers. I hope this is very much fruitful for you. And uh, if you have any query or any um, query, you must ask. I am become so happy because when my learner asks the question, they always appreciate my learners. Sir, what is IoT? Uh, uh, dear learners, the IoT, the new concept in the information and technology, Internet of Things. We just uh, go through this IoT. Uh, just a minute, IoT. Yeah, this is the very new uh, technology. It's like uh, all of you are um, uh, just um, uh, thinking. A uh, lot of the uh, uh, robotic tasks happen in our society, completely that is done by the computer software, like robot. Uh, so IoT and uh, these. Uh, um, uh, one word is the uh, important. Uh, suppose uh, your mobile is uh, just uh, open through your uh, uh, eyes uh, structure. So these are the very important things uh, that is uh, very much popular in nowadays in the information technology. In the same way, the IoT is also working. Just please, I am just uh, describing your that point also from your content, please. Turner. IoT, uh, the Internet of Things, very, very popular in nowadays. In I, uh, dear learner, uh, the network to from the uh, from the Internet of Things, uh, basically IoT is uh, the new uh, terminology come in our uh, society. Uh, related to the in and, and to the information uh, technology uh, so uh, in nowadays a uh, lot of the um, our uh, computer engineers are working uh, in this uh, area iot is a very very new area uh, we can say it is the physical objectives that connect to the internet it can uh, be a fitness tracker uh, how you are taking the uh, use of this uh, uh, in uh, our business, in our uh, various type of the uh, uh, purposes. Uh, so IoT is the important uh, in detail. We will discuss further and uh, very important. You must know uh, the one thing is the IoT. We need, uh, we take the use of uh, IoT in our business. This is the very important for you. If uh, any further, you must ask. I am so happy. Thank you, sir. Because uh, being, a, being a manager, dear uh, learner, you must know what are the various things are uh, in our society. Because we all are the manager. We, we must know what are the various devices are in uh, available in the uh, market. Uh, by that, we can uh, develop our business. This is the important. Suppose how the uh, drone uh, camera work, we must know the application of the drone. We can use at any capturing of any event. But when we know, then only we can use now. So being a manager, you need to know the a lot of the aspect related to the information technology. I it is not you become the expert of the information technology because that is the area of the M Tech in the computer science or. Uh, uh, MSc in the computer science, but we as a manager, we must know everything in general way. How the things work, what is the networking, what are the various important devices, etc. That is the important. 
being a uh, learner of the MBA. That's why this paper is keep in your uh, syllabus. Yeah. Okay. Thank you, my dear learners. I am so happy because thank I you, love you. Thank you. For uh, this is time three to four for attending today's 17th November 2020 is this information system for managers academic council class. God bless you. I hope all of you uh, doing self study in very good manner and in the IGNU national uh, Indira Gandhi National Open University self study is the mantra of the success. Okay, and whenever the counseling class is um, scheduled, you must attend because something you will get. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir.